Hey guys, welcome to ASA Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to enable Secure Boot for Windows 11. Secure Boot is a part of the Unified Extensible Framework Interface, which is known as UEFI. And the UEFI is a new interface which defines the standard between the operating system and the BIOS or framework on the computer. If you are wondering how to enable Secure Boot for Windows 11 or Windows 10, then this video will definitely help to enable Secure Boot for Windows 11 computer. But note, if you can't find the Secure Boot option in UEFI framework, this may be due to the following two reasons. Number 1. Your system or motherboard manufacturer has not provided UEFI framework Secure Boot functionality. And number 2. If your BIOS or UEFI framework version is too old, and when a BIOS or UEFI firmware update is required. In that case, you can check out your system or motherboard manufacturer website to see if there's an appropriate BIOS or UEFI firmware update for your device. However, let's take a closer look how you can enable Secure Boot on your Windows 11 computer. At first, let me show you the Secure Boot status of this currently running Windows 11. Go to Windows Search and type ms info and press enter ok as you can see the bios mode shows uefi and secure boot status off to enable secure boot you first need to go to your pc's bios you can restart your computer and press the bios key to enter your pc's bios or you can go to windows search and search for change advanced startup option and press enter Ok, once you enter in Windows Recovery section, then under Advanced Startup, click on Restart. Now keep patience, it will take you to the Windows Advanced Recovery environment. Now click on Troubleshoot. Click on Advanced option. After that, click on UEFI Framework Settings. Now click on Restart. After that, it will take you to PC's UEFI Framework Settings. If your UEFI or BIOS has an Advanced mode, then switch to the Advanced tab. Or if your UEFI or BIOS has limited, then go to Boot tab. Now carefully look for the secure boot option or security functionality under one of those menu listings. Ok, once you found, then select the secure boot option and press enter. And select enable. And press enter to turn on the secure boot option. Note, if the secure boot option is grayed out in BIOS or UEFI framework settings, then here's a certain tutorial for you. Or, if you want to know how to add a secure boot entry for trusted for executing or how to add a secure boot entry for your operating system, then here's a certain tutorial for you. However, now navigate to the save or exit tab and select save configuration changes and exit from BIOS. That's it. So, I hope this simple guide was helpful for you. If you have any question, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.